clearly been poisoned again by Gary the Poisoner, and the mandatory sexual repression chips that we put in our elderly citizens have well, once again backfired, this time making them far, far hornier than ever. However, there's something plaguing our city far worse than any of those issues. Cold, hard drugs. These figures don't lie. However, things don't have to be this way. As chancellor, under my five-year plan, all drugs will be eradicated. And that's the Klugnugment promise. Thanks to our new Keep Slim City Clean initiative, we've managed to keep drugs like Fergal. Okay, that's got to be the way into the slums. Here, let me sweet talk these two um, weirdos. Hey, uh, Kit, uh, excuse me, can we get our, uh, we need to make our way into the slums, please? No. Hold on. So you really want to get into the slums, huh? Then shed a little bit for oh, us. Come on, come on. Don't, don't, don't make him answer this, no, man. I want to know. It's fine. We'll, we'll help. Okay, great. If you saw us at the bar, which of us would you ask out? I, I guess the red guy. Whoa, seriously? Okay, come on. You, you don't gotta say that just to make him feel better. He's a big boy. He can take it if you think he's way uglier than No, no, no. They said me. They picked me, dude. They picked me, not you. They picked me. They said I was hotter, not you. <laughs> well, it's true. Look at you. I'm not a liar, man. I never lied in my life. I look at you and I see Bill. No, well, well, that's not what they said. They said I, they picked me. I, they said I was hotter. I, did you say that? Listen, we're not switching around here. We picked the red guy. That's the direction we're moving in. Thank you. Thank God. Thank you so much for that changing. I really thought you were going to flake on me. No. Thank you. No, fuck you. Change your mind right now. Pick me instead. This is insane. I am so much hotter. You, you need to chill out. All right, they picked me, and that's final. That's a final pick. If you want to throw a fit, do it on your own time. Just let me have this one time, man. Hey, thanks for being honest. Look, don't tell anyone, but you can go through my door anytime you want from now on. Our little secret. Free passage in and out of the slums. Wow, thank you. you. You have no idea how helpful that is. Well, my door's locked forever. You made an enemy today. You're never, ever going to get to use my door. Well, you know what? That's fine, because we have this other door that works just as well. I think we handled that as best we could, you know? I've never been topside. Oh, Lord. Oh, it's a topsider. Not interested. Hey, oh my god, I broke my fucking leg coming down that pipe. Be careful. Sorry to hear that. Well, well, <laughs> look what we got here. Fresh meat. Hey there, fresh meat. Welcome to the slums, fresh meat. <laughs> Oh boy, here we go. Fucking kid. What's wrong, Fresh Meat? You scared of a little kid? Eh, yeah, I'm a little kid. Whoa, 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 what are you doing? Come on, he's just a kid. D don't shoot him. Oh, you don't want to shoot me just because your gun said not to. Just because you're your little gun. Oh, but you look, look how shootable I look. I look so shootable. I'm not shooting a kid. Go ahead. Do it. Shoot me, Fresh Meat. Shoot me. Ah, you shot me. I'm dead. Eh. All right, there. Are you happy now? Well, I, I didn't think we'd be allowed to kill him. Yeah, normally, killing children in games isn't, isn't allowed, but he's dead. We killed this kid. Are, are you happy now? We killed a kid. A kid is dead now. There goes our E for everybody rating. Attention, Bloom City citizen. You are wearing an unregistered bounty. Shit, shirt. we gotta take Prepare down these drones. Die. So it finally happened. Someone killed my son. Y your son? Yep. The kid up there who always calls everyone fresh meat. We are so sorry. Listen, don't get used to that. We're not killing any more kids. I'm drawing the line, so savor it. Enjoy it. It happened. Tuck it away in the old memory book. No, it's fine. He was 30 years old, so don't feel too bad. 
30 years old is still adolescence for our species, but it's not as bad as shooting like a five-year-old or something. So don't worry, you just did regular murder. And I warned him over and over. I said, don't sit up there calling strangers fresh meat or some gun-toting psychopath is gonna shoot you dead in cold blood. And you went and did it. Good for you. Anyway, please, just leave me to mourn. Jesus. You can't pass through here. It's Nine Torg's turn. Jesus, enough with everyone getting in our way. We just want to kill Nine Torg. Yeah, right. You kill Nine Torg. Get lost, shit heel. Hey, what are you doing? You can't. What the fuck? Holy shit! You just killed Jason. Jason's dead. Hey, hey, oh shit! Here we go. We're gonna have to kill some of these Torg foot soldiers to prove ourselves around here. These people think we're weak. Not on my watch. Some kind of bounty hunter. I got all this great information I could share. I'm just sitting here, fishing away, waiting for someone to come over and ask me stuff. I'm just gonna whistle to myself for a bit now. Hello there, friend. Can I help you? So, uh, what, what exactly are you doing out here? What? I'm fishing. You can tell I'm fishing, right? Oh, right. Duh. Of course. Of course. Sorry. That, it's it's very obvious. Yes. So, ha have you caught anything? No. Never have. Never will. No fish can live down here in this sludge. If there aren't any fish in there, why are you fishing? What's what is that? What's going on? Because I'm still working up the courage to drown myself. Yikes! Wow. Okay. TMI, maybe a little bit. Do you know how we can get to Nine Torg? Buddy, all I know is fish, and I barely know fish. But let's just pretend there's a laundromat you can sneak through to get to Sludge Works over there. Are we pretending, or is there really a laundromat? Come on, kid, take the hint. Either we're pretending, or Nine Torg's goons kill me for squealing. Okay, I got it. We're pretending. Oh, Christ, just follow that path along the sludge. Uh, you're a wise old fisherman. Can you tell us a little bit about Nine Torg? Quiet. She's got ears everywhere. Or antennae. Whatever ants here with. Is she really that dangerous? Come on. I mean, she's just one gang lord. Just one? <laughs> what about the other eight Torgs? Wait, so the Nine and Nine Torg is... It's a counter? There's Nine Torgs? Nine clones, yep. And that's just what's left. There used to be even more of them, but they always kill each other. Fighting for dominance over what? This hellhole? <laughs> This month, nine Torgs in charge. Last month, it was 14 Torg before they killed her. Now, nine Torgs fighting with five Torg. It never ends. Which one do you prefer? Uh, eight Torg is the hottest. So, uh, how do you like living down here in the slums? It's sort of colorful down here, at least. What? Are you serious? This is one of the worst places anyone can live. You can't see that just by looking at it. It's more sludge than anything else, and the sludge is toxic. Oof, sorry. Yeah, that sludge does look pretty awful. No, the sludge is the best part. It's the quickest way out. Just hop in there and you got a one-way ticket out of here. Imagine if we didn't have the sludge. Then we'd really be trapped. Anyway, yeah, living here is bad. Hey, thanks for the info, uh, wise fisherman. We'll see you later. Have a good day now. Oh, hey, you want to see a cool party trick I used to do? Aim me at those platforms. Come on, come on, give it a shot. It'll be fun. Oh, yeah, I told you. Did you? 
you see how fun that was? I call it my glob shot. It comes out of my trick hole. All Gatlians have a different kind of trick hole. My, mine does this. Boy, you are learning a lot today, aren't you? Yes! Yes! Oh, oh my god, I could do this all day. Doesn't this fucking rule? God, I love spewing big gloopy globs. There's usually some good loot inside, but we need some kind of sharp device to open it. Yeah, we can't get inside that lug locks without something really sharp. Sure. Don't shoot! I, I got an idea. It's another trick up my little slimy sleeve. Try hitting him with my glob shot. Take your time and aim right. Hey, come on. You know what to do, pal. Come on. You know exactly what to do. You know what Poppy likes. Shot, you fucking nailed it! How sick was that? Whew, okay, I gotta recharge. It doesn't take too long, but it's nearby. You know, my, my, my body gets too tense. It's, it's like trying to piss when someone's watching, you know?
Looks like he was die clean only. All right, this has to be the way to Nine Torque. Well, let's keep moving. Oh, that's a lug locks over there. Hey, careful with the merch. Whoa, 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 hold up a bit. Let's listen. Up and everything. They're gonna be here any minute. Just, just patient. Oi, fuck you! I'm sick of this. I want to tear through someone's guts. Oh, I think they're talking about Gene's knife. Ah, fuck you! Got it, freak. We've had enough of your bullshit. Yeah, it's your fault Stevulax is dead. I was in love with him. Did you know that? I loved him, and now his head's cut off. Just the way it should be. Fuck him. Hey, guess what? I have another secret trick you can use. The power of negotiation. Let's try reasoning with these guys. Knock on the door. Tell me how you oh, want to play you this. Fuck you, insufferable fucking cunts. When I'm loose. Oh, you... Uh, who's there? Who are you? Uh, hey. Hello there, friends. Oh, I, I think it's the buyer. Hey, are you the buyer? Uh, yeah, we're here to, uh, buy, buy a knife? You guys are selling a knife, yeah? Oh, perfect. You're really late. We were starting to get worried. Just go with it. No shooting. All right, here's the product. A genuine talking knife. I gotta be honest with you. He's a real piece of shit. He's extremely violent. He basically only talks about wanting to kill people in very disturbing ways. Fuck you. I'm gonna carve out your anal cavity. Gonna make it three times as big. Your shit's just gonna drop right out of there. See what I'm talking about? Oh, uh, perfect. That's exactly what we're looking for. Oh, fuck yes. Thank you. Pleased to meet you. I'm Knifey. Now use me. Use me. Let me fucking stab these cocksuckers. Oh, fuck yes! Fuck yes! More, more! I need more stabbing! Hey, you, listen. Point me at your raw, fleshy little tummy and jab me right into there. Let's get all those guts torn up. Let's see that fucking red goop spill out. I can't stop now. Oh, uh, that's a pass for us. Is this really the knife Gene was talking about? Gene? Did you just say Gene? Okay, change of plans. Bring me to Gene. So I can fucking decapitate him! Wait, what? Why? He sent us to rescue you! Oh, that's rich. There's no way I'm forgiving him, though, for leaving me with that fucking Nine Torg. He's dead to me! Huh? You know Nine Torg? We're trying to kill her! Oh, perfect! Finally, we're on the same page! Let's kill Nine Torg, then Gene! Okay, definitely Nine Torg, but l l let's put a pin in the, the whole Gene thing. H how do we get out of here? With my tether ability! I'm more than just a knife, you racist! I can tether too! Look up and latch on! Fucking cool, right? You gotta use me to swing across this sludge. Oh, fuck yeah! Not as good as stabbing, but still pretty good. Well, all right. Where, where to next? The sludge works processing plant. Nine Torg was talking about some traitor she had to deal with. Probably another one of her clones. Five Torg or six Torg or whatever. I don't know. There's too many now. There's too many Torgs. How many clones are there? Who the fuck cares? Stop thinking so hard and just look for the big sludge works sign. I want to stab somebody. So you, uh, mentioned that Gene gave you to Nine Torg? Cave? Try gamble me away in a game of space poker? That sack of shit? Can't wait to stab all three of his fucking eyes. Even the wonky one. Especially the wonky one. Hate that one. Locks. Excuse me! I can open those fuckers up real good! And this looks so Yes! What happened to Gene? Didn't he used to be a hero? Yeah, he used to be. Hard to tell these guys. The only thing I was cutting for him was sandwiches. Not even the good ones. Peanut butter. No fucking jelly! Not even like ham or anything good! Nice! Well, what's this mind for? Do you deal anyway? 
She's the current matriarch of the Tall family. I say current. Spot. You know how it is with clones. Okay, feed me that Gatorall, baby. Come on, put it in my little mouth. I have... Oh, mama, mommy, uh, that's the stuff. Oh, sludge works. Nine Torch should be here. Torque. Any last words, five Torg? Is that nine Torg talking? Fuck off! I've always said you were the worst Torg! You know, seven Torg said the same thing. Right before I killed her. Damn you! And you're next. You got this! Place was 
sludge! Stay in the air! <laughs> Better not fall in! Hey, I'm still here. You can still use me if you want. I can deflect attacks, did you know that? I'm not just all about stabbing. Well, I'm mostly all about stabbing and tethering, but I can also deflect attacks. I'll slice them the fucking dead. I'll cut their fucking heads off. I'll fucking I'll rip their limbs. I'll fucking do everything. Oh, I'm gonna fucking cut right into them. I'll cut their fucking asshole off and eat it. Yeah, bitch! Bounty Hunter, I, I feel pretty good. I, I, I really didn't know if we'd be able to pull it off. All right, it's time. Time for what? Time to carve out a piece of her. I'm thinking we go with a full slab of thigh meat, but since it's your first... Oh, God, I can't look. I can't. I can't. <laughs> oh, fuck hell, she's a gusher. Could we have just taken, like, a fingernail, some spit, a, maybe a blood sample? Yeah, sure. Could have, I guess. Hey, I'm Five Torg. Thank you for killing my evil clone. I don't mind if you mutilate her corpse, really. It's fine. You did such a good job. That was, like, off the hook. You're not gonna take over and end up being just as evil as Nine Torg, right? Oh, uh -huh. don't worry. Things are gonna be a lot different around here. So, no more crime, then? Oh, not that different, then. <laughs> Technically, all of us Torgs are evil clones, so I'm still gonna do a bunch of crime. But we're cool. Huh. As far as I'm concerned, you're a friend of the Torg family and welcome here anytime. An honorary Torg. You can be ten Torg. Now, if you'll excuse me, my day just became very full. All right, let's go home and turn in our first bounty. Hey, you know, that was some pretty solid bounty hunting back there. I mean, I mean, don't don't get too cocky about it or anything, but it was pretty cool. Yeah, not bad. That was some good killing. And I'm somewhat of a killing expert, actually. I can't wait to see Gene's face when he sees we pulled this off. Let's head back up through the slums tunnel. I don't know why that guy even bothered attacking us. I almost feel bad. Feel free to keep exploring, but whenever you're ready, we just gotta go through the tunnel that we ca came here in. You know, that tunnel? Oh, you're back. Hey, yeah, my leg's still very broken. All right, let's do a cooldown lap. Hey, fuck you! I'm still. 
real pissed at you. Hey, I hope you had a good time in the slums. Come visit any time. Yes, don't talk to me. This time making them far, far hornier than ever. However, there's something plaguing our city far worse than any of those issues. Are you tired of boogers clogging up your nose? Well, don't do it anymore. Get huh, why is the door closed? Dead. That's right. Forget it. Who is it? You got my munch dash delivery? What? No, it's us. Why? Oh, shit. Why? Really? Good job. Oh, hold on. Is that Jane? Okay, get ready. I want you to stab me right into his fat little belly. Painful. It feels really bad, and I, like, my boogers aren't that much of a problem. Thank you. Thank you for that. You have. What the hell, Gene? He installed new locks because he assumed you'd get killed. He keeps saying it's his house now. What? No. I just took the liberty of upgrading your security. Did you really kill Nine Talk, though? Yeah, we actually did. Well, well, well. Didn't think you had it in you. I'm really blown away. I'll be honest with you. I expected you to die. Oh, thank you. So, what did it feel like killing Nine Torg? Look, I gotta be honest, it felt good. It felt great. I mean... Hey, Gene, lift up that shirt and expose your soft little belly for me. I'm coming in hot. Yeesh. Forgot how psycho he was. Why don't you just, uh, hold on to him for now? Oh, sure. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll keep him far away from you. Yeah, thanks. Now, uh, go turn in your bounty at the Bounty 5000. I got it all set up for you. No, seriously, let me stab him. Well, there you go. You're a real bounty hunter now. Huh, would you look at that? I, I guess we're really doing it. Yeah, I didn't expect you to get your footing so quick. I don't even have any leads on any G3 bounties. You are, uh, serious about going after them, huh? You bet. We'll, we'll take them all down, including Garmantuous. Well, you're welcome to try, and if you do, you might want to go to the pawn shop and buy back the Dodge unit I pawned off. Forgot to tell you about it. Go scrounge up some pesos and buy that, or whatever else tickles your fancy. I'll have some G3 bounties ready for you by the time you get back. Sure, sounds good. Thanks, Gene. Just maybe next time don't assume we're just gonna die. Right. Got it. You're really gonna need that Dodge unit from the pawn shop. The suit's not really complete without it. Look, I know Mr. Keeps annoying, but you gotta put up with him and buy back that Dodge unit. Okay, fine. You don't wanna go to the pawn shop? Well, I'm not doing any more research on the G3 until you do. Jump into the fire! Jump into my brain! What, while you were off murdering a gang lord in the slums? How is it down there? Any cool shops, or is it just sort of depressing? Everyone up here just makes the slums sound really depressing. I'm probably just gonna not go down there, to be honest. But it is pretty crazy you killed a gang lord. And she was a woman, though. Not very feminist of you to kill a woman in power. So this is your bedroom, huh? It's fine. I mean, I don't, I, don't, I don't really know what I was expecting, to be honest. Hi. 
<laughs> How you doing? Hi. I'm sociology. Yeah, sure. Uh, Gene said you might have the old Dodge unit that goes with this bounty suit. Oh, yeah. We got that. Why? You want it? I want it, too. So it'll cost you. Uh, yeah, yeah. No, we, we know how buying stuff works. Hey, whoa, easy there, Tancho. We gotta buy the Dodge unit first. All right, there you go, one Dodge unit. Have a nice life. All right, we got it. Let's try this bad boy out and then head back to Gene. Okay, great. You got the Dodge unit. So how about it? Think you're ready for the big leagues, kid? What, what do you mean? The big league! The G3 cartel! That's the next step, taking down their head officers. Okay, um, are you, you're positive that we're ready for that? Yeah, whatever. Might, might as well try. But they won't be pushovers like Nine Torg, so, uh... Well, to be honest, I don't care if you live or die. You know that. You know my whole deal. But, uh, hey, it's your funeral. So go check out the Bounty 5000 whenever you're ready. Got two G3 leads for you right now. Krubus and Douglas. You can pick which one you want to let kill you first.
to my brain. Dinosaur music inside my brain. Sometimes I feel like I'm gonna go. Zephyr Paradise. Gorgeous, huh? A G3 Grenton. Okay, now the cartel knows we're here. Whoa! brought me here a couple of times. Looks like they haven't ruined this part of the jungle yet. Listen, if any part of you is feeling bad about killing these little mites, don't. Uh, leading scientists looked into it and uh, they, they, they have no feelings. They, you know, they're just like, I don't know, what do you have on your planet? Like fish? Does that, does that translate right? Translator micro. It's nice to kill something guilt free, you know? Kill you, you fucking mites! these things. Okay, do you know what fan plants are? You shoot the little bud and then the, the thing does... Okay, yeah, you, you figured it out. Oh, shit! I can't hear you, I'm heading into a tunnel. No, I'm just kidding, just some uh, cell phone humor just to lighten the mood, you know? Oh, a Fergal den. Oh man, you, you, you know, you actually have a lot in common with these guys. You know, aside from all the hair, you know, you're both being sold as drugs to, for aliens to get a high off of, you know? You guys are, uh, it's, it's like you're almost related in a way, you know, if you think about it. Jeez, I didn't want to embarrass them back there, but that tunnel reeks of Fergal shit. You fucking G3. Oh shit, okay, G3 are warping in. You ready to fight? You need a cup talk? here. This is great. Stay back. Oh, sorry. I thought you were a 
tree. They enslaved our whole village. I don't know what to do. I think we can help. Billy, thank you. It sucks so much watching everyone you know getting enslaved. Toxic shit. Just swarming with cartel guys. How, how, how do you want to deal with this? I can't do it. Rescue some guys? Hey, listen, guys, we, we got you. You're free now. Go be free. Hi there. Did you save us from the G3? Yeah, I, I guess so. You know, do, do we get like a, a reward? Uh, we don't have much. Maybe you should hit up our leader.
Welcome, welcome. We are Moplets, native to this planet. Our tribe is forever in your debt. Our leader would like to speak with you. Oh, okay, sure. Hello there, savior. My people were enslaved by the G3 and forced to desecrate the land mining for Fergals. You may have freed this small tribe, but our brethren underground are still being worked to death by Grubis. Krubis! You know, we're actually looking for him to kill? What's this? You aim to take down Krubis of the G3? You are truly a hero to Moplets everywhere. Yeah, yeah, sure. Uh, where is he? We'll, we'll get rid of him for you. Hmm. That's difficult to answer. His work, though evil, keeps him very busy. He oversees many different minds across Zephyr, and it's impossible to predict where he may be on any given day. My liege, what about the man in the mansion? Ah, of course, a brilliant plan. My advisor is right. There's a man nearby who knows Krubis and has access to a warp device. We may be able to use him. He lives in a mansion across the river. If you could get your hands on his warp device. That could be very useful. Okay, sure, a guy in a mansion, th 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 that's the plan? Yes, he would appear to be our best chance. Godspeed, savior. C can you tell us a little more about Krubis? I've only come face to face with him a few times, but he's, he's an irritable one, that Krubis. I think he resents having to manage the mines. Probably would prefer doing something a bit more glamorous. And he takes all his frustrations out on us. Oh man, I'm sorry. Sadly, there's nothing that can be done about it. Unless you kill him. That would do the trick. Why were you guys all imprisoned? The G3 are a cruel bunch. They did tests on us to see if we could trigger psychedelic reactions like a drug. But when we proved useless in that regard, they put us to work mining Fergals instead. Man, good God, you know, you, you, you just can't win. You're either a drug or you're a slave, I guess. Yes, and those poor Fergals, so helpless. They're making us destroy their lives, their habitats. It's so gruesome. Basically, our lives are super fucked. It's, uh, it's not good. But you freed us. Everything changes now. What's the guy in the mansion like? Oh, his name is Ranchi Delarma. He warped in not too long ago. Seems to be old acquaintances with Krubis. We haven't dealt with him much, but he seems to have a penchant for Fergals. Oh, God, he's a drug addict. Nonetheless, we may be able to use that to our advantage. He does have close ties with Krubis, after all, and he seems a bit disoriented. Right, because of the drugs. A and he's evil still, right? Well, yes, he's evil, so it should be morally just. Yes, let's all just agree right now that it's morally just to manipulate him. I love it when we can agree. Hey, thanks for your help. Very well. Godspeed, saviors. Thanks again. It really means a lot to not have to be a slave anymore. Oh man, no problem. Hey, somebody warped in over here. I bet we can cross now. You're the one who fucked up the coordinates. How are we gonna get this thing out of the river? I fucked them up. I just typed in what you told me to type in. Yeah, you typed it in wrong, dickhead! Now we're flooding! Oh, sure. It's always my fault. You know what? I'm asking for a transfer when we get back. Oh, wouldn't that be nice? Go ahead! I can't wait! No, fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! No, fuck you! Fuck you! Ah, fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! No, fuck you! No, fuck you! No, fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! No, fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Oh, no. Up we go!
I'm not G3! I'm quick! I'm a designer! I was just flying around here trying to make new friends! Oh, that's cool, but you know what? We're, we're busy! Oh, don't worry! I won't be too much of a bother! It's nice out today, I'd say. Sometimes there's storms and it destroys everything and I have to rebuild my shack and... Oh, it's a nightmare. But I digress, you know, I don't... Did you know? Rosa, look at you go! You're really playing! You're trying to copy me! <laughs> I think you want to be just like me because I'm so cool! Well, tough luck! I'm the only one don't try to be a fuck you! Shit, this guy won't stop! What was I saying again? Whoa! Nice try, but I'm too fast for you! Actually, I used to work for the G3! Now that was impressive! You're a real pro! Who taught you how to shoot because I wanna shake their head! I wanna kiss them on the... ...that lip! I wanna bother them and get them and yes! How sad! That's normal! It's what you do when you're in love, idiot! actually came to buy something. Okay, hey, please, hey, please, hey. please come back and buy more later. Yeah, yeah, promise me. It's for my dad. You must have bought something really good in there. I'm proud of you. In fact, I'm attracted to you. You deserve all the good things you want! Oh, whoops! I just realized I'm late for my big date! I'm gonna go fuck another really hot Grayton! Wish me luck! It was so nice meeting you! Finally! Thank God! I don't know how much more I could have taken!
Huh, I don't see a warp device on you. Oh, come on, is Krubus making you hoof it around on foot? Oh, that cheapskate bastard, same old Krubus. I'm telling you, man. <laughs> Here, I got an extra. Don't let anyone ever tell you Ranchi's not a generous fella, okay? There's an unused warp disc in there, too. You know, warp in whatever's on there. I don't care. It's free of charge. There's a river near here. You can probably cross with it. Oh, man, go nuts. <laughs> you warpaholics. <laughs> wow, th thank you. Hey, hey, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Lean in close. Get close to me, man. I'm sure Krubus told you I'm here on Zephyr to break ground on a new Delarmo Land Resort. Yeah, I'm that ranchy Delarmo, CEO, Delarmo Industries. This one's gonna be even better than the one on Glassboard 12. Trust me, man. That guy's busy as shit, always hopping from site to site. He's got like 30 different mines all across Zephyr. You think I can keep track of that? Fuck. I see him when I see him, okay? I, I wish you'd take some time off, though. Hey, I want to talk to him about Delarmo land. I, I'm sure you've been to Delarmo Land before, probably the flagship Glashborg 12 location, but buddy, you would not believe the regulations we had to abide by over there. Real motherfucking sticklers. So I had a Krubus, you know, make a deal with the G3, and now we're setting up a brand new location here on Zephyr where ain't nobody gonna breathe down our necks about safety protocols for background checks on all the performers. <laughs> and you're probably wondering why nothing's been built yet. Well, I might have got a little bit sidetracked. Drawing up blueprints takes a lot out of me, you know? So I unwind with a little fergal or two. Sue me. But we're making good progress. Yeah? Or will be. Soon. Another thing. Check out the scale model of the new Delarmo land, cause <laughs> it's got a lot of detail. <laughs> it's gonna be the planet's only all-inclusive pansexual drug bazaar. On the beach, you can get your rocks off while getting your surf on. And I can have all the Fergals I want. That's just a per- On top of a- A rock solid development plan. And once I stop enjoying the perk, I'll get right back to planning this resort any day now, as soon as I've had my fill of the Fergals. Oh, man, Krubus. <laughs> what a guy. You see that photo over there? That's the snap of me and the crew, man. That shit was like, I don't know, 20 years ago, man? That's how long we've known each other. He used to be a real wild man before he turned into such a frickin' stodger. You know? Mm, I got clean. Mm, I got sober. <laughs> All paperwork and shift management. I mean, crew, man, you work for the space mafia. You think you'd still have a little fun every now how and then. How much money does this guy have? <laughs> oh, and I'm not, I'm, I'm I'm not saying that because of this room. <laughs> I'm, I'm thinking maybe a so heist, hard you know, right later. Sorry uh, really? I don't smell anything. It smells just it. fine in here. Okay, uh, uh, okay, okay, the high is wearing off and I'm starting to feel a little antsy, okay? I need some Fergals, pronto. All right, okay, we got a warp device. Um, you know, that's gonna be helpful. Why don't we use it to cross this river so we can go talk to the Moplets and check in with them? Looks like they're working on fixing this portal. You know, hey, maybe we can use it later, you know? Okay, uh, let's use this warp device Ranchy gave us to cross the river, huh? Hey there, it's me, Sudo. I'm back. Uh, looks like you're trying to use that new warp device you just got. You want me to help you out? Diving right back into Gene's old porn archives. Even AI can jack Come on, off. Fucking move. Hey, shit, where nice you work. Go. You know, we can use the space as a bridge. Fucking traffic. Hey. Holy shit, where the fuck are we? Hey, you wanna the check shit, in I with the Moplet leader? Cause you know it's, that's kind of what we're supposed to do right now. Fuck up. I'm gonna fuck my you. Ass. It's there! 
Sam! How was the man in the mansion? R Ranchy? Yeah, that guy has serious problems, but he gave us this warp device. By the gods, you've done it! You got the warp device! This might actually work. You continue to provide us with hope, Grand Savior. With this warp device, you can warp Krubis directly to you. How fortuitous! But alas... You'll need his coordinates and a blank warp disk to encode them onto. Hmm. Oh well, no way you're getting those. That stuff's in the mines. We could just go down there and get it right now. Oh right. Take this access code and head down to the mines. Everything you need is there. Okay, perfect. Thank you. You know, you, you guys figured out that whole plan for us. You know, that really means a lot. You know, it clears things up for, for us, you know, anyway. Yep, uh, we'll, we'll get it done. All right, let's use the passcode and get in. Nice. Jeez, are the G3 even trying to domesticate the local mites? G3 ran into trouble. I may, maybe they'll sort this out for themselves. to the mines? Jesus, they really fucked this place up. I didn't know it had gotten this bad. These guys just don't let up, do they? <laughs> Gotta be honest, uh, they're, they're looking for the G3, but still better than our friend from earlier.
Okay, great. Whew. All right, now let's try that elevator. Okay, this should take us down into the mine. Going down, huh? Sorry, I, I almost made a crest joke, but I'm, I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna save it. We're better than that. No crest jokes from me, that's a promise. Not from me, anyways. You might warp in some bases, and Lord only knows, but you know, from me over here as a gun character sidekick, no crest jokes. 100% on the level with you, and no bad stuff. Fuck, it stopped? We're looking for a blank warp ticket and some way to find out where Krubus is. Let's get to work. Ah, nobody's gonna miss you. Okay, yeah, there's no way we're getting past that laser grid. There's gotta be some some way to shut it off somewhere around here. Oh shit, oh shit. Let's give him a glob shot right out of my trick hole. Attention, mine Operation 12C. It's me. Holy shit. Hey, he's got a Gatlion. We, we gotta rescue it. trying to keep things on schedule and I figured maybe you forgot that if you piss me off I will kill you it's really easy to find more slaves look just do your job and mind more Virgos crew is out is that your first question I don't know Merle uh, excuse me speak I've got to go we'll talk more later bye Merle I'm so sorry. I didn't see you there. I'm Helen. I just need to know, are you the new hire or the new boss? Uh, actually, we're, we're just looking for Krubus. Big deal. All the new hires want to meet Krubus. Well, tough luck. Do a good job with the paperwork, then maybe we'll talk. Uh, as a matter of fact, um, I, I am. I am the new boss. Absolutely. Yeah, right. You're not, honey. <laughs> That's funny, though. I like it when the new hires have a sense of humor. <laughs> Let's get y'all set up. Head on into the next room and find a place to work. Go on without me. I haven't left this chair in years, and I don't plan to start now. <laughs> oh, thank God they're here. Hey, you must be the new office clerk, right? Just sort through that paperwork for us. We're so small. Ah, uh, shh. 
sure. Uh, yes, I will see what I can do. Oh, geez. Okay, this is more paperwork than I anticipated. All right, better get to work. So, you still good for Hyper Feast later? What time did you say again? Uh, Zorg. Oh, yeah. Zorg totally works. Hey, newbie. You know Hyper Feast? They create new life in front of you and you get to eat it alive? Shit's wild, man. Hyper Feast. <laughs> See you there, girlfriend. You're my girlfriend. We're dating. No, I, I kind of don't mind this at all. Oh, my God. I'm going insane. I'm going fucking nuts. What? Yeah, I... Uh... God, I think my brain's breaking. I think doing this job is making my brain break completely. Oh, yeah, me too, me too. And done, finally! Oh, yeah, me too, me too. It's fun. You don't mind your brain breaking? Well, you don't mind this, this fucking monotonous nightmare work? No, no, it's nice. It's cool to just give into a broken brain. I can't do math anymore. And if I stay here another year, I think I'll forget how to say three-syllable words. Okay, that honestly doesn't sound so bad. It's not bad. It's terrific. Fantastic. Amazing. Three words I won't be able to say next year, so savor them now. Oh, buddy, I will. Ow! Paper cut! Uh, just kidding. <laughs> it would have been you. You would have been the one to get the paper cut. I, I, I don't know. I find this kind of relaxing. I gotta work. say, glad we got that all done. There, are, there hey, definitely is not going to be a third step. Ah, uh, the cold sting of irony. Is is that ironic? I, I never really know. He said Zork. Zorg. Ah, right, right. Damn. I just remembered I had something going on at Zork. Holy shit, I, I'm, I'm gonna blow my fucking brains out. What? Oh, I didn't see it there. Do you, do you still sit here? It's so funny. Yeah, this is still my spot. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. It does, it does, yeah. I, I, I think if I if I sit back down at my desk, my soul is just gonna leave my body. Okay, well, I've got work to do. Oh, yeah. Okay, we're done. No more paperwork. Did you hear me? I said no more paperwork. Not even a fourth stack. Okay, good. God damn. You filled out those papers like a son of a bitch. Like a real bitch you are. Fuck you. You're, you're promoted. You're free to go into Krubus' office. Why? Because fuck you. That's why I don't need a fucking reason. I'm boss McBossington. And I'll be in here jerking off or whatever. Huh? So this must be Krubus' office. There's got to be something here we can use. Wait. I feel like we missed something in there. You know? Look, I know it seems hard to find out where Krubus is, but you can do this! You know, you can find it! It's not, it's not like there's that many things in here. Krubus, where are you? This is Garmantuous. I just checked the log and you're three days behind schedule with the latest shipment. But you know what? It's not that big of a fucking deal! These Fergals aren't gonna be worth shit now that we discovered humans! Might even have to shut this whole operation down just to get all hands on deck over on Earth. I can give your territory to the Scrandle Brothers and have them expand their facilities to find out more about these humans. Oh, you tried one of these fuckers yet? Oh, God, the high? It's otherworldly. Can't believe a species like this really exists. Humans! <laughs> Who'd have even thought? Anyway, don't fuck up again, even if it doesn't matter, or I'll smoke you myself. Oh, would you look at that? He, he marked his coordinates on the calendar. Shit. All right, now we just need a blank warp disk to encode this on.
Hey, listen, we're here to help, but what, 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 what's going on? Ah, d d don't, don't get me in trouble. No, no, it's okay. We're friends. We, we hate the G3, too. Oh, wonderful. Thank God. So, what's your plan? We have started a resistance. Not only do the G3 enslave us, but they have desecrated our holiest of sites and absconded with our sweet prince. Prince Chosen One, that's, that's him. Prince Chosen One. Oh, that's awful! So, so you kidnapped this G3 merc as a bargaining chip to get your prince back? Oh, hmm. Yeah, that's smart. No, we, we didn't think of that at all. But it's fine, we know where the prince is. They swapped him out with the rest of our sacred grounds when they warped in a new base. So you want us to go clear it out and then warp the throne room back? Oh heavens, would you really do all that for us? <sighs> the base is just past this tunnel. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <clears throat> is his name really Prince Chosen One? Yes! He was named as such according to the prophecy. Huh. And then after that, he was made into a prince. So you trust your leaders to prophecies. Is he a good prince? Well, the prophecy doesn't guarantee he's going to be good at his job. <gasps> it just tells us who to pick. Look, I, 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 I don't know. I don't know. Look, now is not the time to criticize us. We're, I'm just, you know, I'm just stressed as it is. I'm just doing my job. Listen, we're looking for a blank warp disk. Do, do you have any ideas? Ah, yes. Our prince has a stash of them. Really? All you need to do is clear out the warp base the G3 plopped on in our holy land. Oh. Then you'll reclaim the sacred grounds and rescue Prince Chosen One. And then he'll give us a blank disk? Yes, oh, yes. We, we can help each other. Oh, what a fortuitous happenstance. Oh. All right, we are off. Oh. Wow, you know, we, we're about to rescue a prince. You know, I'm a, I'm a little nervous. You know, I, I hope he lives up to the hype. Hey, listen, when has a prince ever let anyone down? You know what I mean? Oh shit, this must be the place. Okay, let's clear it out. outside and use this to reverse the warp. appropriate and what the hell do you want jeez it jeez we, we just saved you you know maybe you could be a little grateful saved me from what i'm fine look we were told you had some sort of blank warp disc huh yeah 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 sure i've got a bunch okay we got everything we need let's get back to ranchy's place and see if he you know can help us encode them onto this machine Prince Chosen One has returned! All has been restored! Prince Chosen One, I am so sorry, but we're out of Plagorsh. Can I interest you in some Plagorb? I don't want Plagorb! I want Plagorb!
Luigi, we're back. Let's let's head inside. Hey, uh, you're back. Oh, thank God. Thank fucking God. Uh, did you bring my Fergal? Uh, I need a bed. Uh, I need my fix, kid. Oh, I need a bed. I need it real bad. Oh Jesus Christ, man! Hey, are you all right? Uh, are you are you having a heart attack or or? Is it, is it Fergal withdrawals? Does that make you happy? Oh, you love that, don't you? You love to see him. Uh, master of industry, all flummox like this. All... all right, looks like it's working. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. Uh, uh, maybe this is a bad time, but can, can we use your disc encoder real quick? What? No, the encoder is off limits until I get my guy. All right, there we go. Time to warp in Krubus and then, you know, kill him if, if, if we're able to. Y you ready? Virgils, get him! Hurry, hurry, hurry! Uh, hey, tell you what, we're gonna go ahead and use the disc encoder while you're sort of uh, stuck on the ground like that, doing whatever it is you're doing. So don't be mad at us. Fuck. Fuck. What? No. Hey, I've got a crazy idea. What if we just swap out this mansion for Krubus' base? Who the fuck are you? We'll all be damned. We found Krubus officially. Hey, come down here, asshole! Hey! Where you going, Krubus? Jack off! I'm gone! Fucking kill me. Just one little furrow to help me get my energy back up. Honestly, how do you even do anything with drills for hands? How do you eat? Right? Look, I'm not judging. I, I, I don't have any hands at all. I, I actually don't even know why I'm walking up this tree. Kiss them. Here comes 
You fucking teasing me? Let me carve him up! Let me do something! <laughs> Let me in there! Oh god, this feels amazing! You have no idea! Oh god, I'm in, I'm in heaven right now! Oh, oh, you should see this! Oh, ripping three crew tenants like their butter! Oh fuck! Oh, oh. oh I was really getting my gloves off there, wasn't I? Sorry about that. Ooh. Hey, bud, the name's Gus. Feel good to meet you. Look at you, man. Pretty slick taking out Krubus like that, rescuing me from indentured servitude, etc., etc. I love that kind of stuff. You know what? I love that. That's the kind of stuff I love, man. Do you mind if I tag along with you for a bit? I, of course. I, I, that's what I was hoping you'd say. We can use your help. But I should be clear that we are trying to take down the whole G3 cartel, and we might die. Music to my ears. You think I don't want to take down the cartel? Buddy, that's all I want to do. That's all I dream about. Amazing. God, I'm so glad to find another Gatlian alive and well. I love your tiny little hands, by the way. I, I, I had a cousin who had those tiny hands. He died in the zombie apocalypse on Gatlas, but, you know, look, I'm sure you don't want to hear about that. We had to live through it. I mean, you know, who wants to talk about that? Oh, shit. Time to fight. Hey, you're not supposed to be down here. No, 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 don't shoot this guy. Let me show you what else Papa Gus can do. Fuck you, get out of here. Whoa, what the fuck? Pretty chill, right? Use that whenever you want. It's cool. <laughs> and I see another wall you can climb. You see that, right? Hmm, still a little far away. I'm not sure you can jump to that one. out of the G3 because he was so damn annoying. He's lonely, he's bitter, and get a life. Some people need a life, and he needed a life, man. G3 was worth it.
You think I'm supposed to be impressed that you killed a G3 officer? You, well, okay, yeah, fine. I am. I think it's pretty insane you didn't die. That's all you're getting out of me. Now, turn that bounty in. Oh my god. Hey, you gonna turn in that bounty or just loiter in my living room? You, sorry, your living room. For now. Over here, Sheriff. You're not gonna believe this. What is it? Oh, cool. You got yourself another talking gun? And this one's green? Wow, who cares? No one. Oh, okay. Okay, that's fine. Be rude. My name is Gus. Not that it matters to you. Here we go. Look at you. You're getting the hang of this bounty hunter thing already. How'd the mission go? They killed a G3. Looks like I taught them well. Wow. Really? Whoa. Okay. Well, I'm impressed. <laughs> Yeah, I was, I was always hoping you'd find your calling. I just I didn't think it would be bounty hunting. But then again, I don't know what I thought it would be. Maybe hairstyling and not good at it. And what's wrong with bounty hunting? Ugh, can you please tell this dried up sack of shit to go home? I don't want to share a couch with him. Tough titties, Leslie. You're kidding me had a deal. It's Lizzie. And that's not my kid, Jesus, we're siblings. Sorry, I don't know how your species works yet. Sibling, fine, got it. Doesn't change a thing. I live here now. Come on, can't he find his own place to stay? Hey, that's not right. I'm barely taking up any space. You know we had a deal fair and square. Oh, come on, we barely know this guy. You're really gonna side with him over your own sister? Hey, you should be proud. You raised your child to have proper respect for a good, fair business deal. Oh, now I know you're doing this on purpose. I'm the sister, not the mom. But you knew that, didn't you? Sorry. My bad. You come waltzing back in here stinking like dirty Flimborg, of course I'm gonna get distracted. You shouldn't be hanging out with that Flimborg boy, you know? Can't trust that species. Tweak's harmless. And nice. You're being spacist. And he's not my boyfriend. Yet. Trust me. Flimborgs are bad news. Come on, have my back here. Okay, yeah, you got me there. Thank you! God, I just don't think I can take much more of this guy! What, you think this is easy for me? If I'm pissing you off, at least you can leave. But my legs don't work. I'm stuck listening to your boy trouble every time I'm trying to watch my stories. I can't even get peace and quiet in my own home because there's an alien cripple jerking off on my couch 24-7. Hey, c come on. That's a high estimate. Ew, I was kidding. Yeah, me too. I was kidding. We all know I was kidding. Aren't you going to say anything? Whose side are you on anyway? Hey, uh, all right, I, I, I can see I'm being a little bit of a bother. I mean, look, I'll, I'll try to keep it down when I'm uh, watching my stories. Just don't uh, put me back on the streets. I really do want to help you. Fine, he can stay. But only until he finds somewhere else to go. I'm grateful. I mean it. But I've already missed half my program, so can everyone just shut the hell up? Ugh. All right, that's enough excitement for one day. You got more bounties to get to, kid. And you might want to check out the pawn shop to see what you can spend your new payout on. Eh? Yeah. Mm. Oof, that was tense. It's times like these I'm, I'm almost relieved I don't have any family left alive. But, but not really. I, I miss them a lot. Hey, uh, just so you know, you can use the Bounty 5000 to revisit any planet you've been before. There's portal doors all over. You can just uh, use them whenever and grind for money, look for loot you miss, whatever. Up to you. Just thought I'd tell you. Oh my god, is that weasel? <laughs>